Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope from the 17th of December to the 23rd of December. And this is for you coming from Scorpio. So let's start with Sunday the 17th. And that happens to be a very good day for you. And the morning afternoon periods, you will be extremely lucky and you will have long-term planets to give you the bonding you want with whoever you are, whether it's with your marriage or romance or family people, or whether it's with the people that you are working with or even playing golf with business partners, is going to be a great bonding morning, afternoon and early evening period. The evening and nightfall period also remains very good. And so you have a bonus of a very good Sunday the 17th. And everything you try to do on that day, mix business and pleasure because it, both sides planets are very good. So you'll have a wonderful productive Sunday. Monday the 18th starts brilliantly for you and it's going to end very well. And so you will have planets who will give you plenty of support at your place of work, good news in business as well and the opportunities of chasing for a romance also there. So everything you attempt to do wants to give you dividends. And so you should concentrate on what is important in your life. You can't have everything on a very good date. So focus on what you really want and you'll find that the opportunities are going to have dividends and a good payoff for you. Evening and nightfall remains also excellent. So continue to have your exposure with people, enjoy yourself, socialize, go out and mix business, mix the business partnerships with your personal partnerships. Everything has a beautiful tendency to give you what you want to make you happy. And then we will go to your area of Tuesday. And Tuesday planets are a little bit not cooperative. So on Tuesday, you can have some trouble in terms of ego problems. And these ego problems can isolate you from people at work. And if that happens, you're not going to get teamwork. And that's why the morning, afternoon and early evening planets tend to give you problems of getting help and soliciting some support in what you want. So improve your tolerance for everybody and it will improve everything that the chances of doing more success. Evening, nightfall, I like the planets very much. These are planets of communication and these are planets of business as well. So again, mix business and pleasure. It's a day where you can meet important people and especially in the evening, nightfall session, you can produce your good communication and marketing sense as well. Or just treat the evening and nightfall as a full enjoyment, you will also be able to do that. Let's go to Wednesday the 20th, which starts not well for you and is not going to end well. Here are 24 hours which are going to produce plenty of trouble for you in one way or another. The morning and the afternoon periods, there's emotional planets who trouble you extremely. And these planets are going to cause trouble in your area of romance and marriage. And the trouble is strong enough to bring it down to a serious problem of even breakdown. So watch out then in areas of romance and marriage and family, there's a lot of disturbance from these emotional planets who basically make you emotionally a victim. And if it is the problem created for others, then try not to retaliate. You got to stay calm on this day of Wednesday the 20th, morning and afternoon. And even in the evening and nightfall period, your luck does not increase. It continues to bring trouble in relationships, in partnerships, and whatever you do and however you do it, there's always a danger of being blamed for something or another. So at that kind of a day with frustration where progress finds plenty of hurdles in all areas of your life. If you don't really need to socialize, don't. Because during that evening, nightfall, the planets double up which means that they produce the double the sort of problems. There's no solution. Just go back to the safety of your own home. Drive carefully. Don't drink too much. And being emotional, you will tend to be emotionally carried away. Thursday the 21st improves a lot. And here we see a much better day in the morning and afternoon at least. 
and it produces plenty of support from whoever you want in area of job, in area of business as well. It's a morning and afternoon showing expansion. So whether in business, in job or whether looking for a new romance, the expansion, word expansion can be applied. And you will have the opportunity of showing plenty of success morning and afternoon. The evening period is a different story. You don't do well in the evening and nightfall period. And you have to be careful that the evening and nightfall period can let you down and bring disappointments. It can cause accidents which are not only physical but also verbal and also emotional accidents. You can be let down in a way you can be cheated. You can be in the company of people who drink too much or do other things which they shouldn't. And so influence of this planet must be avoided. So if you don't really have to be out, it's better to just go back home and be safer there. We'll go to Friday the 22nd. And Friday the 22nd shows plenty of good opportunities for you. And the morning, afternoon, these short-term planners will, deserve, will deliver to you all that you want very quickly. So communicate, ask favours, show off your marketing sense at your place of work or in business. Chase for the contracts you want. You are going to make very good inroads, sometimes even unexpectedly, in morning and afternoon period. Evening period and nightfall is also good for you on this Friday the 22nd. And here we see many planets of long term. They are a bit slower, so we call them long term planets. And they are there to give you the bonding with whoever you are with in the evening and nightfall session. So you might want to mix business and pleasure so that you have the business side of it, also entertainment and also the personal side. It's going to pay a lot of dividends for you on this Friday the 22nd, the whole day. Saturday the 23rd begins to a very good day as well. It's a Saturday, but it can make you impatient, it can make you hasty, it can make you argumentative, these fast planets. So try not to allow that. Now the morning, afternoon, you're going to be very busy with plenty of things happening. I can see all the plans are extremely exciting and uh, you will have the chance of mixing black pleasure and mixing business as well, business planets also seen. So see which area of life you want to really go for to improve and you will be able to do it in the morning afternoon session. Evening nightfall session becomes even better. Now some of your major good planets are there and so they want you to meet important people. They want you to do things where you can build a base for yourself. So it's an evening and nightfall where entertainment or getting together with people, you have to again think of what area of life you want. You cannot have everything in one day. And when you have decided which area you want, you go for it. If it's love and romance, go for it. If it's wanting to make your family members and your wife happy or your husband happy, then go for it. If it's wanting to build up your betterness with the people you work or with the people you do business with, then you concentrate there. Whatever you do, you're going to have plenty of good opportunities. And so that's your, 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 your Saturday the 23rd for you, an extremely lucky Saturday for you. Now I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 50.50 for a 90 minute Skype session. And during this 90 minutes, I will tackle your next five or six or seven years in all areas of your life, your next five, six or seven years. And I'll have your date of birth and I'll have your time of birth and I'll be able to look at your palms. You can send me photocopies of your palm, uh, photo pictures of your palms uh, to my email and I'll be prepared for the Skype to even read your face. And so I can also use Kabbalistic Tarot if you want. It'll be an intense 90 minutes, year by year, calendar year by calendar year and age by age to see how you're going to do in your five, six or seven years. So until then, I wait for you to contact me on Skype or on Facebook or through email and let's get down to making your next five, six or seven years the best possible. Until then, thank you and good luck.